Ghana card, the identity of people, even dead people, can be established using their fingerprints. Ghanaian and other embassies abroad will be able to establish the identity of Ghanaians using fingerprints. Identity can be established even without the Ghana card. As long as you are enrolled on the database and you, you, you put your fingers on the application, you can be uh, verified. It is not widely known, ladies and gentlemen, that the Ghana card is also an e-passport that contains biometric information that can be used to authenticate the identity of travelers. The government, since this year, has been working with the International Civil Aviation Authority organization, ICAO, to globally activate the e-passport function of the Ghana card. And I'm happy to announce, I am happy to announce that on 13th October this year, the Ghana officially became the 79th in member of the International Civil Aviation Organization Public Key Directory com Community. Ghana's country signing certificate authority would therefore soon be imported into the PKD system through what is known as a key ceremony. The key ceremony for Ghana will be held at ICAO headquarters in Montreal before the end of the first quarter of 2022. Ladies and gentlemen, what does the, all this mean? This means that by the end of the first quarter next year, the Ghana card will be recognized globally as an e-passport and can be read and verified in all ICAO compliant borders. That is 197 countries, 44,000 airports in the world. When this happens, holders of the Ghana card will be allowed to board any flight to Ghana. Furthermore, the good news for diaspora Ghanaians is that when the Ghana Immigration uh, Service is linked to the NIA architecture, and that will be soon, diaspora Ghanaians who hold the Ghana card should not have to obtain visas to return to Ghana. And the Ghana card project, we're quite proud to say, was implemented by the, by the NIA and a local Ghanaian company. It's a world-class company. And we are, this is Margins, IMS. And we are proud of them. 